On the House floor Friday, Representatives Jim McGovern and Nicole Malliotakis clashed over crime. Republicans proposed legislation forcing prosecutors in liberal cities to disclose the number of violent crimes that take place in their city. McGovern bashed the legislation, saying it was just creating more paperwork and wouldn't have an impact on crime. Mally Takas took umbrage with the Massachusetts Democrats' characterization of the bill, saying, quote, Crime has soared in my city. People are getting killed. McGovern fired back, saying the proposal does, quote, nothing more than call for more reports to be sent to the Judiciary Committee. The gentleman reserved his time. Uh, the gentleman from Oklahoma. Thank you, Madam Speaker. I yield myself such time as I may consume to quickly respond to my friend. Crime is also a problem all across the country. And we will work with you on the 9-11 uh, uh, survivors bill, which I point out again was originally my colleague from New York's bill, uh, as opposed to a Democratic proposal, but give you credit for picking up a good idea that my friend uh, originated. And with that, I also want to yield 30 seconds to my friend to respond. I understand that my colleagues on the other side of the aisle don't believe in transparency, okay, that they believe this information should be kept from the public. But these prosecutors work for us. And quite frankly, crime has soared in my city. People are getting killed. People are getting assaulted. Nearly every single category of crime has risen in New York City, and our prosecutors are refusing to put people behind bars. So if the Democrats feel that public safety and crime skyrocketing America's cities is not an issue, explains why you support defunding the police and bail, and bail reform and all these ridiculous policies. The gentleman from Oklahoma. All that she wants, but what I took exception to is the fact that a, a proposal that essentially does nothing more than call for more reports to be sent to the Judiciary Committee is somehow fighting crime. Um, and, um, and I would also tell my friends that, uh, you know, uh, let's, let's not talk about defunding the police when my friends on the other side of the aisle have members that are now selling t-shirts to defund the FBI and law enforcement, or, let's, or, or the fact that many of them voted against uh, bills last week uh, that actually funded, uh, provided more funding to the police. But I mean, come on, uh, you know, reports, reports somehow are going to fight crime. I mean, if, if, if that's your crime fighting solution, well, you know, America's in, tr in trouble. Uh, with that, I reserve my time.